I don't know. I don't know. Uh, this next segment did not make any sense to me. I, I don't know who uh, planned the order of these things happening, but Roosh was in a backstage vignette with Jose and and uh, what's his name? Uh, Pellegrino? What's his name? Uh, oh yeah, Pino De Grigio. Yeah, yeah, Pino, yeah, Pino, Pino Noir. Oh, what's his name? I, I can't, I can't remember his name. Pero, 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 Pelo, Pelo Grosso, Pelo Grosio. Uh, what is it? What is his name? Preston fucking back. Vance. Okay, go back to the dark order, man. MJF interrupted this interview. Now MJF was in the last segment, being pulled away by officials after a brawl with Takeshita, and he shows up in this segment. Wearing a scarf, a different shirt, and the world title. He's just fucking So either he, dra- either, either he left the brawl and immediately changed his shirt, took a shower, and got dressed, and made himself look like he was going out to a fucking $1,000 dinner with his wife. Uh, I, I, don't, I don't know why this segment showed up here instead of earlier in the show. Because the, 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 this placement did not make any sense to me. No, no, that was kind of weird, man. It was very, very weird. bizarre. I mean, this, the segment makes sense, you know. I mean, anybody facing Brian, he wants to make sure that whoever it is gets extra incentive to take him out, you know. But, yeah, it seems like he'd be a little worked up, disheveled, and just all over the place after the brawl he just got into with Takesta, so. Well, I don't know, man. Maybe maybe, maybe MJF is a wizard. Could be. Could be. Maybe he learned from Jericho. I don't know. Harry Potter's game is coming out this Friday. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, did you hear that, um... Fight Forever, it got a soft release date. It, it's it's now saying February. It's saying it's saying this month is coming. Really? Yeah. Yeah, I would assume so. They want to release it to uh, steal WW2K uh, 23's uh, same bullshit <laughs> yeah. away from them. Oh, yeah, yeah we added War Games. What? Yeah. Meanwhile, you release yeah. a fucking gameplay trail that shows zero gameplay and the same <laughs> mechanics as the last game. And geeks are going to pay another $80 or $90 or whatever for the expansion or for the, for the big uh, edition. And, and what are you uh, getting? Oh, man, we're getting war games. I'm sorry. Does that warrant a $90 fucking purchase? Probably no, not. I've never bought a, a WWE no, 2K. I would game. not recommend. I um, heard that the, 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 the delay was from um, their rating. Yeah. I get, there was an issue with their rate. I mean, I, I hope they're not going for a, a rated M. Tag here. Nah, I mean, I mean bro. Uh, what type I think of, it's already teen. So what's what, the, what, what's the difference? Teen. I mean, there's so many worse games out there. Oh my god, there's blood in a wrestling game. Oh my well, god. Me, meanwhile, we're fucking shooting zombies and fucking alien creatures all year long. Yeah, and but, Call uh, of Duty's uh, a M- yearly thing. Oh, no, 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 AEW Five Forever's got a hold up on the rating. Well, an M rating fucks with the sales. Big time, because kids can't get. Well, why would it be an M rating? The fuck well, is in the game that it's an M rating? That's what I, I mean, blood. But, I mean, I don't know. They, they, they said the issue is over the rating. You figure it's got to be already at least easily a team. It's going to be a T easily. But if there's an issue with it, that means it's probably higher. So that's why I'm thinking, like, maybe they tried to give it an M. Maybe they had to back it down so they didn't get an M. I don't know. Listen, I can't wait for the game. It's going to be a staple on this channel. I can't wait. That's going to be a Tuesday night stream. We're going to. Have fun on Fight Forever. Hey, I'm with it, man. Um, so basically, MJF is paying Roosh to basically injure and break the arm of Danielson next week. Um, Roosh nodded, said some things in Spanish. MJF asked for a translation and said whatever he said, he, you know, he didn't really appreciate it. Uh, we have a deal, MJF said. Uh, sure, sure. Just uh, make sure you get the job done. So uh, Roosh versus Danielson should be a uh, banger next week on Dynamite. Oh yeah, it'd be good. That that'll be. It's one of those matches where you're like, man, Rue should be in a fantastic match with like Brian Daniels. Well, here you go. Yeah, you're getting it. You know that seems like a, just a fantasy match. You know, we're getting it. 